Michael Kidd, and I have to kind of get a couple things clear before I tell my story. Uh, one is, I'm a firm believer that uh, if it's really offensive, as long as it's equally funny, it's okay. And another thing is, I love all people, shapes, and sizes. I want that to be clear. Uh, anyway, so I went to uh, Montgomery County Community College. Yes, I know, I got in. Um, pretty cool. And uh, I had this one Tuesday, Thursday class. It was a history class. And I used to get there a couple minutes early before I'd go in and uh, talk with a couple of people there. And one of the uh, people there was this girl, Gaby was her name. And uh, she was kind of hot. So I would come to class early. I really didn't think I had to be clear about that. Uh, we would talk a lot, and then the teacher would come in, and we'd you know, shut the hell up and start learning or whatever. And uh, one day she was talking, I forget how it came up exactly, but uh, Gaby at one point said, uh, oh yeah, you know, I probably know more Hebrew than anything else. And I said, oh, you're Jewish. And she said, yeah. And I was like, oh, geez, that sucks. I'm sorry. Um, just kidding, obviously. Um, want that to be clear. And uh, the class went on. And uh, that was it. That was like the Thursday. The next Tuesday comes on. I'm strolling in class. I'm in there real early and everything. And uh, Gaby's sitting in my seat. I'm like, yo, Gaby! What the f***? That's my seat. And she's like, oh, I'm sorry, Mike. Um, well, the left-handed desk's over here, and I know you like, you know, you're left-handed, so I figured you could sit in my seat. And when I looked at the seat that I was supposed to be sitting in, and I looked at the girl next to her, uh, next to that seat, and I was like, well, I don't know this chick. I don't want to talk to her. I don't even know her. And I turned around, I'm like, I'm just kidding. What's your name? She's like, it's Jen. I'm like, Jen, I'm just kidding. I'm just messing with Gaby here. And Gaby's in the background, way to go, Mike. You're digging yourself into a bigger hole now. And I'm like, well, you know what, Gaby? She forgave me. It's a Christian thing you wouldn't understand. <laughs> now, well, people are laughing. I'm just going to tell a story to you because you guys are going to be to me. Because I'm totally joking the whole time. Um, <laughs> So anyway, she kind of laughs, she's like <laughs> And laughs and then goes on And turns around and starts, you know, whatever So as class starts, I'm looking over at her, you know, bat my eyes And she's looking at me kind of like <laughs> So I decide to write her an apology letter In the only way I know how um, Which is putting my foot even deeper into my mouth So I'm writing, I write the letter and I go to pass it to her And straight up, like I'm in sixth grade no lie. You guessed it. The teacher catches me. Uh, Michael, can you, uh, what you got there? Uh, nothing. I don't have anything. Like, no, what you got me? No, I got nothing. I don't have nothing. And, uh, she's like, come on, bring it up. I'm like, ah, oh, damn. Uh, so I bring it up, and there was, like, that part of me where I was thinking, like, I could just totally bull this letter, says. But the other part of me that likes funny things, he's like, I can totally just read this word for word. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, again, to clarify, if it's, <laughs> it was very offensive, but equally funny, it's all good. And I'm a fan of all people, shapes, and sizes. Um, and this is how the story, or this is how the letter goes, and this is the caught, by the way. Dear Gavey, let me start off by saying I have a tremendous respect for you and your people. <laughs> you guys have been through a lot. <laughs> Jesus himself was a Jew. <laughs> and we all know he went through a lot. If you don't know anything about Jesus, I'll tell you. Just a pretty cool guy. Probably the Bono of his time. Bono mixed with Rambo and God. Anyway, Jesus was a cool guy who hung out with hookers and homeless people all day and fought the man. Uh, the man of his time was the Romans. And actually the Jews. Your ancestors tried to kill my savior. But don't worry, no hard feelings. You guys couldn't even do that. Now, unlike you guys, my entire classroom Silent. Silent. But when I said that, you guys couldn't even do that. I heard that, uh, uh, I look up and there's that guy who just woke up for the first time after the semester. And I was like, anyway, Gaby, 
In summary, I'd just like to apologize. I hope you can adopt the Christian idea and forgive me. Let's face it, you need all the friends you can get. You have God as an enemy. Sincerely, with love, Mike. There was no applause, I'll tell you. No. Uh, and this was 15 minutes into an hour and a half long class. And about a month into like a six month class, where I was no longer Mike, I was called Mel Gibson for the rest of the day. Um, that's my story. Thank you very much.